Hey, this is Elaine, and in this video, I'm sharing with you Playa Blanca and Islas de las Rosarias in Colombia. Through the Couchsurfing website, I met Will, who is also known as the Cartagenian who helps people on tours, so he helped me book this tour. We were to meet the tour company at 9 a.m. underneath the Puerto de Rolo. <laughs> Going to Playa Blanca is really inexpensive. For the day, it cost us 55,000 pesos, which is about $27 Canadian. Not bad at all. Also includes lunch. There is an extra port fee of 12,000 pesos. Again, about $7 Canadian or so. Still not bad. Um, and if you want, you can go directly just to Playa Blanca. You can go to Playa Blanca and Islas de las Rosarias, and there you can go snorkeling or to the aquarium, or you can actually just go for a few nights and you can even just rent a hammock. We are on a small boat with about 20 people and we're going to Playa Blanca. And we have these lovely life jackets that will save our life. However, it doesn't really lock up. <laughs> Apparently that wasn't our boat. We had to get off and now we're waiting for our boat to come so we can go to Playa Blanca. We finally made it to the right boat and it is worth the 55,000 pesos. As you can see, it's much nicer. Doesn't it look more spacious? A bit? The life jackets work. The life jackets work. So there's this guy who was on the speedboat and he was so scared and he was screaming to the driver uh, because it's a speedboat so the speedboat I guess it, go it goes against the water and it's going doom, 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 and it's going really fast and water was drenching us um, and the guy started screaming like Bare! which means like stop and, he, and then he said like I didn't pay for extreme sports if I wanted to I would have paid for it and you have to stop and he and, and he's screaming at one point he's like and then everybody started laughing. It sounds, okay, maybe it doesn't sound funny or it sounds as though it's so mean, but it was really funny. Just his reaction. And I was inside, I was like, huh. okay, so imagine, Bree and I were sitting in front and he was behind us and he was screaming and everyone was laughing. I didn't want to laugh, but I was like, I was like, like kind of frozen and just like laughing like that. And um, so that was definitely the highlight. And the thing is, if you, there was different options of boats. If you knew that this was a speed boat and you, you're scared of speed boats, then you shouldn't go on a speed boat. It's really that simple. So, looks so yum. I've never seen girls with ass implants before in my life. So I went to the washroom, I was coming out, and then all of a sudden I was like, damn, like I was looking at this girl, she had like big boobs, small waist, and then went out, like it didn't even look normal. She looked like a cartoon, I don't even understand. So it was so crazy, and it was my first time experience um, seeing girls with ass implants. And not only do they have ass implants, but I guess maybe in Canada, I don't know how it is in the States, we're more conservative with our bikini bottoms, but there you can see all of their ass. Like you can see everything, it's unreal. So they probably think that, you know, Canadian, like North American, you know, American Canadians that were so, I don't know, or hey, maybe you wear a sexy bikini bottom. Maybe I'm just the conservative one. Lot of skin. So I don't know. I don't even know what to say, but I just had to share with you that it's kind of crazy to, that was another experience at Playa Blanca. And if you're an ass man, I guess you'll see a lot of ass. <laughs> 
If you like this video, please comment, like, and subscribe. Thank you so much for watching. Muchas gracias and many more videos of Cartagena to come.